batch 38. Batch 22. Batch 34. Batch 3. Batch 38. Batch 14. Batch 20 ng Voice Works. Ako nga pala si Pucholo, the Voice Master Gonzales. Bakit Voice Master? Kasi Voice Teacher. And ako ang pinaka unang tao na nagtayo ng voice acting school sa Pilipinas at nakakatuwang isipin na after 11 years, no, may git 1,500 na yun nag-graduate sa voice works, basic voice acting workshop. Before, nung nagsustart pa lang ako, syempre medyo nahihiya pa ako, pero nung nag-voice works ako, na-build up yung confidence ko. Uh, Na-enhance pa nito yung communication skills ko. Nakatulong sa akin to get opportunities to do voice work. Main uh, purpose ka talaga bakit sumali ng voice works is to meet Sir Pocholo. Kasi before ako sumali, uh, nag, uh, nag-google na ako kung anong voice acting. The gateway for for me to get into the world of voice acting in the Philippines because of voice works, even before I finished the uh, workshop, I was already translating uh, telenovelas and then um, dubbing sometimes and then doing voiceovers. I wouldn't be here, I wouldn't be a voice actor at this time if it wasn't for voice works. So you're not just learning from one person, you're, you're learning from a pool of different experiences combined and that allows you to learn despite of whatever uh, level of experience you have, be it a newbie, you be a newbie or if you're a professional, there will always be something to learn. And even if it's just 5%, that 5% could change your career dramatically. At karamihan ng mga bagong dubber dito sa ABS-CBN. And I can claim, galing sa creative voices. Siyempre, sino ba naman yung mga teacher ng voice works? Di ba? Si Danny Mandia lang naman, ang tinuguri ang ama ng makabagong dubbing industry sa Pilipinas. Siya lang naman yung aking mentor at siya yung unang tao na naniwala sa kakayahan ko. Siyempre, nandiyan si, si Neil Tolentino, si Papa Neil, siya, ang isa sa pinakamahusay na writer, translator, at director ng dubbing, especially mga Korea novela. At ang pinakamalupit na teacher natin dito, siyempre, si Alex Agkawili, ang supremo ng voice acting industry, especially sa dubbing. Ah! Oh, okay ka lang! Oh, tignan niyo to! Ah! Ah! Dito, siyempre, yung partner natin, si Brian Ligsay. <clears throat> si DJ Big Brian, uh, siya rin ang Voice Works Director. Siya yung kasama ko right from the start na nagsimula ang creative voice, especially ang Voice Works. Uh, Bata mo pa, tapos landian mo siya. Mama! Okay? Mama! React, react. Yo, reaction. Uh, I teach on uh, more on character voicing. Alam mo, ang voice acting, hindi lang naman yung pag-iiba-iba ng boses. Kung hindi, paano mo share no? Yung knowledge at skills through your voice. Simply, uh, you act in front of a microphone. You change your character, you change your voice. Binibigyan mo ng, ng art or binibigyan mo ng buhay, yung isang dialogue na kung saan binabato ng isang dubber or kaya radio drama talent. Using this kind of voice even if it's not what you're using in your everyday life. So, sample lang yun. Living another person's life, another character's life. Uh, voice acting for me, it's something that I loved ever since I was young. When we talk about theater, we have the stage. When we talk about film, we have the cameras and uh, the set. Whereas in voice acting, it's still a performance just behind a microphone. Kaya ayokong tawaging voice talent kasi ayokong ginagamit ko lang yung boses ko para kumita. Dapat voice artist. No, ginagamit mo yung boses mo dahil nandiyan yung passion mo. Yan yung ang artistry mo, siyempre yung, uh, yung pinakamahalaga. Nasa puso mo yung ginagawa mo. Yung masterpiece mo, you, you treat anything na binosesan mo as your masterpiece. Parang painting yan eh. No, kailangan ibigay mo lahat ng mga pwede mong ibigay. Hindi ibig sabihin bago ka hindi mo ka pwede gawin. Ibigay mo na lang lahat. Kasi hindi ako naniniwala sa datihan eh kung hindi naman bagay. Oh, nakakahiya naman. Kakaiba yung kwento niya. Narinig mo ba? Ano ba? Gusto nga natin ito. Sabi ko dito sa iyo eh. Oh! Ano? Sudo ka lang. Sige, sudo ka lang. Ano? Ano? Haulo ka eh, no? Ano si Raulo? Sige na nga. Pasok ka. Oh! Dahan-dahan na! Oh! 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 Uy! Tingnan nito. Oh! Ayos ka lang mo. At dahil dyan, napakarami na nating naproduce na mga voice artists at nagbabalik nga ako after Six years, no? Bumalik ako sa ABS-CBN since 2010 when I re retired for four times. Four times, no? Four times na ako nag 
pabalik-balik dito sa ABS. Sina Mater Tenera Brarum. At uh, babaguhin natin ang voice acting industry sa Pilipinas na naging vision ko na yan since I started Creative Voices. And I can claim na it really changed a lot. Kasi tayo nag-create ng supply, kaya nagkaroon ng demand. Kaya abangan nyo itong napakagandang uh, documentary ng Voice Works. Really recommended.